Hook timing is one of the more complicated adjustments on any sewing machine. It should be a last resort to solving stitching problems. The hook assembly is fastened with three set screws that eliminate the need to routinely retime it. If you've exhausted the other troubleshooting techniques, or if the sewing hook has physical damage to it, proceed with these steps for timing a hook. The first step in hook timing is to be sure your needle depth is set properly. If you haven't done this yet, back up and repeat the section on needle depth. Here are the tools you will need to time the sewing hook. A slotted screwdriver, a Phillips head screwdriver, and a two and a half millimeter Allen wrench. Now, let's get started. As you see here, we still have the cover off from setting our needle depth. Remove the throat plate as we've done here. Rotate the degree wheel to 24 degrees. The point of the hook should be directly behind the needle, in the middle of the scarf of the needle, and approximately one to two thread widths away from the needle. Here is a properly adjusted hook. To adjust the hook, loosen the three set screws on the hook assembly. You'll have to rotate the sewing head to get all of the screws. Set the degree wheel back to 24 degrees. Position the hook point directly behind the needle and less than a business card width away from the needle. Tighten one of the set screws on the hook assembly. Tighten the other two set screws, then check your timing again. Replace the throat plate and test the machine. If this didn't resolve your sewing problem, Contact Bairdon America's Technical Service Department for further assistance.